Oh, this place has some bad memories for me. new job for you. Do you know what gerrymandering is? Of course you don't. You're a regular American just like me. It's boring egghead stuff involving redrawn voting districts, blah, blah, blah. Anyways, the election's coming up and them eggheads tell me I'm fucked in the polls because those goddamn peggies ain't gonna be voting for me. Say what you will about lunatic cult movements, but the bottom line is they vote. Now, the eggheads say the only chance I got at winning would be to go back in time and gerrymander them district lines so the peggies ain't counted. And that got me to thinking I could just as easily win if them peggies just didn't show up to vote. Now, I'm not telling you how to go about such a thing, wink, wink, but a permanent solution to my temporary problem would work best if you catch my meaning. Obviously, I'm not saying to murder anyone, because that's still illegal. It is still technically illegal, right? But if there were less Peggies around, because they somehow tripped and fell on several dozens of bullets, it would probably help my chances. The district in question is up at the crossroads by the Grill Street Diner. You can take my idiot son with you. He's not good at much, but he can shoot okay. And you know, if this were ever to blow back on us, it would be good to have Patsy. I don't even think he'd get jail time on account of him being a little touched. Well, what you waiting for? Get moving. Andy Adler's done that with his son, Marshall Burke. Senior, that is.
work. You and I are damn sure gonna make Montana great again. Tell you what, how about you take old Nancy? You go around cleaning up this county in that truck, and all them prospective voters will know who's got their backs. Oh, and please don't bring her junior back. Ever. You split that switch! Never wore a seatbelt before, not about to start now. Never known how to hurry to the brain and stand in the madness. 
You're lucky you got me. Thought. We have forgotten what it is to be strong. You know our hero used to be God. And now our heroes are godless. Weak. Feeble. Diseased. We let the weak dictate to the powerful, and then we are shocked to find our This is where they take people. Thank <laughs> you. 
job, Deb. Goddamn You're a goddamn hero in my books. Things are looking real good for Briggs. Whitetails are on the way to pick him up. Jacob won't be using a grand view to fuck with anyone now. God damn. I'd love to see his ugly mug when he hears he lost his little torture chamber. You know, you proved everyone wrong, Dad. Everyone except me. Always knew you were the real deal. I'll see you back at the den, soldier. Take care. Good thing you found the wolf's den. Eat the plane went down just over there. Our scouts say that the cargo spilled out all over the place. We need to move fast if we're gonna get it before the piggies do. You managed to escape for a little bit. This is where they take But whenever I want, I can have you back here with me. But you've got time to play your little games. I'll let you know when it's time to come.